everybody, it's Dr. Sam Robbins. Now, I get asked a lot of questions about branch chain amino acids, such as the one I received just yesterday. They ask, Doc, I want to take some branch chain aminos to uh, my pre and post workout um, so I can gain more muscle and also lose fat. How many grams should I take? Also, does the stuff even work? I trust you, so please be honest because it can get expensive. I wanted to take uh, five grams. What do you think? So I'll keep today's topic short because branching aminos aren't new and there isn't really anything special about them. First, just as a refresher course, branching aminos consists of three amino acids, leucine, isoleucine, and also valine. And of the three, leucine is the most important one for building muscle and losing fat. Now, branching aminos can be both anabolic and anti-catabolic at the same time. So that's the cool part. Now, when used at correct dose, they can raise growth hormone, which is the anabolic part, and then also the insulin, which is the anti-catabolic part. Additionally, when taking branch in aminos prior to a workout, as well as during, can help increase testosterone levels post-workout. Thus, the main benefits are from positive hormonal changes. However, many of these studies, you know, facts and figures are based on high doses of branching aminos, about 0.2 grams per pound of body weight. Thus, if you weigh about 200 pounds, you need about 40 grams of branching aminos to get the full benefits. That's very expensive and basically a total ripoff in my opinion. Now, if you aren't going to take that big of a dose, just don't bother. And yes, I've tried this high of a dose, and honestly, it's disgusting, and it made me almost lightheaded. But I did feel some of the benefits, and I did have more energy. I have also taken about 5 to 10 grams of branching aminos and haven't really noticed much of anything. Certainly nothing to justify the high cost. And I did all this for at least a month to see what would I you know, would actually see and feel over a good amount of time. Like I said, branching aminos are nothing new, and in fact, in the early 90s, the magazines advertised how amazing they were, just as they still are doing it now. In fact, I remember when HMB came to the market, which is a metabolite of leucine, the most powerful amino acid of the branching aminos. HMB is, in fact, clinically proven to help build muscle and so forth, but only in you know little amounts. And I've tried high doses of this when I worked you know, with EAS in the 1990s. Still, nothing amazing happened, certainly not at the regular doses. But if you still want to take branch in aminos, I suggest you simply take 25 to 50 grams of a good whey protein isolate. And I made a video about this before, and I'll give you the link to that video in a minute. You see, the cool part is that 25 grams of whey protein has about 5 grams of branch in aminos. Plus, you get all the other amino acids as well, all the essential and non-essential. And it's at a fraction of the price of just branching aminos. So instead of taking 10 grams of branching aminos, you can take 50 grams of a good quality whey protein isolate. Mix it up, maybe even add in 5 grams of glutamine in it. Then slowly sip some of it before, during, and after your workout. You know, it has way more benefits at a fraction of the price of branching aminos. Like I said before, building muscle and losing fat is all about genetics and hormones. You can't really change your genetics, but you can optimize your hormones for maximum benefits and results. And the most powerful muscle building hormone is testosterone. This is why men are bigger and stronger than women. It's not growth hormone or peptides or SARMs or anything else. It will always come down to steroids and the best, safest, most natural anabolic steroid is testosterone. With that said, I've also added a link below on how you can naturally boost your testosterone levels and at the same time decrease negative catabolic muscle killing hormones. Make sure you share the health and let other people know about this video and today's topic so they can benefit as well. Thanks for listening and have a happy and healthy day.